She got us out here lacking, y'all, but we're gonna get this video <laughs> started. Welcome oh, back. Oh, here's my I'm Marion, you feel me? We got special guests on the show today. My cousin. You wanna introduce her too? Hey y'all, I'm Ari the Doll. Add my YouTube page, Ari the Doll. Add me on Instagram, 313 Doll underscore. My name Ari. We're gonna put us in the description too. So if y'all wanna type in, I know niggas be lazy nowadays. So I'm gonna just put it in the description too. So I can just click the link type shit. But for this first video, cause y'all gonna see cuz on some videos from now on. But this is the first video, so we're doing the mukbang to start off. I tell them what you eating. Well, I was supposed to get a two for five. We still got a two for five. And the chicken sounds, but they gave me fucking 20 spicy nuggets. Probably That's where she eat. got that 40 shit from. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I'm like, bro, I didn't even ask for that shit. You know That's where she got that 40 shit from. She was like, do you want 40 nuggets? I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm eating a spicy chicken sandwich and some spicy nuggets. And we're gonna be asking some questions on this video after we done eating and shit. Or why we eating and shit. I'm trying to think what the topic could be. Mm. What's your plans for New Year? Cause I ain't doing no video like that yet. For New Year? Yeah, like what's your New Year goals? My New Year goals? New house, new car, and bigger YouTube. That's three goals. How you planning on getting there, though? Grinding. How though? You could say like, yeah, that's my goal, but you got like, you gotta have steps to get there. All right, shit. well, the steps to get my car that's already in motion. I had to get my my um my ID and shit back, and my daddy helping me get that bitch because that's my daddy. And this plan on getting a new house and shit. I'm thinking about moving out of town, like Tennessee or Texas. My so I was signing up for, yeah, I was signing up for like Section 8 and shit out there. I filed there and shit. So if I see some shit that I like, I can get it. And then YouTube, I'm about to just keep stacking up on videos, going, doing videos with any and everybody that want to do a video know why with you me. I'm gonna be on the channel with your baby. You would be going crazy. Everybody said that, but I'm gonna do a different channel. I don't want her to be on my main channel because I'm probably do a lot of wild shit on my main channel. No cap. That's good. That's good. No cap. So I'm everybody wanna see my daughter. But so I think I'm gonna just make a daughter and mommy page for me and her little family page for me. Yeah, I feel that shit too. Cause yeah, it do be like not I wanna say things, but different topics type shit when it comes to your kids and shit. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, that is a whole nother little word. Y'all ain't gonna see no baby for me for probably another two or three years, though. I ain't gonna lie. I don't believe that. I ain't, I ain't even prepared for all that I'm yet. surprised you don't already got one. You don't know. I can't. Kids, I mean, don't get me wrong. I fuck with kids heavy. Like, anytime I come into... There ain't nobody for us. That look like my daddy car. I don't know what she got us <laughs> off into. But anyway, what the fuck was I saying? Yeah, I ain't having no fucking kids no time soon. Plus, I like not knocking nobody or nothing, but I just gotta have my cheese, right? Because I can't, bro. Me growing up, like, with my parents type shit, and I really couldn't get what I wanted type shit, I don't, I don't really yeah. want them in that situation. Right, that's how I feel, but I ain't gonna lie. My daughter, my biggest blessing, but if I had a choice to wait, I would've waited. But I ain't know he got me pregnant until I found out I was pregnant. And I was losing my virginity, so it was a first time thing. Oh, shit. And he got me right then and there. I ain't gonna lie, that, that's some shit. And then, when I was like, I told him I ain't wanna have a baby, he like, well, I want the baby. And then my grandma was like, well, we don't believe in abortion, so you having the baby. So I was like, damn, gotta have a baby. I mean. It's your body at the end of the but day. But I love my daughter. Well, yeah, her, her daughter cool as hell. She's always giggling, though. She is mean as fuck. You no, know, when I be around, she be giggling like a motherfucker. All I do is see her ass smiling. Her little ass mean. She is sad. So, what's your New Year goals? Mm, I ain't gonna lie. I got a lot of shit I want to do. So, it's probably gonna sound cocky. 
But at the same time, it's like, shit, that's what I'm on type shit. But um, on YouTube, I'm trying to get my shit, I want to say, to 10K by the end of the year. I really, I'm really lowballing myself, but that's just like, I got to make sure I hit 10 before the end of the year on my main channel. My uh, music channel, I want to hit 5K by the end of the year and get that bitch monetized. Mm. It's, a, it's a lot of other shit. I ain't gonna lie. My brand shit, I'm about to drop the site for that bitch. I'm gonna run that bitch. Yeah, up the I be seeing year. that shit. That's your man. brand right there. You could do some modeling shit too once I drop the. Um, you want to be a brand ambassador? Shit. Yeah. Like, I ain't got no. I ain't gonna say I don't got no designs for the women shit yet, but I was gonna wait that shit out to like the summer type shit. Right. That way, like, I can, I can come with more design if that makes sense. Man, I, that makes sense, but. I um I'm doing my little hairline shit. That's why I'm really trying to get my hairline shit. And then I'm doing hairline shit for women and men. I got shit for you dreads. You gonna do hair too, or you just gonna? I already do hair, it. but I'm gonna sell it and I'm gonna go to class. I'm gonna go back to school to actually learn more to be professional at this shit. So okay. I already I was selling bundles and shit already, but I ain't never restocked back up. But when I do restock back up, I'm restocking for nigga shit, female shit. Like, I be seeing a of, lot of niggas of, now, they be using what type dreads of dread, shit. What type of uh, do-rags is, like, good for niggas' hair? Uh, A lot of niggas fuck with that velvet shit. Like, it got, like, Yeah, that's, I don't know, it's shit. like, yeah, you fur can on that it. shit, yeah. Yeah, I, I peeped that. I think I need, I need to get them. The velvet bitches. I need to get them. A lot of niggas like the simple bitches, too, but them velvet bitches always gonna hit. I ain't gonna lie to you, because they help your hair, too, from what right. I know. So yeah, I'm about to, I'm about to, I need to give me some of them bitches. But a lot of niggas start wearing bonnets and shit now too. What? I don't know about that, but. What the fuck? I swear to God, but I get what niggas be on. Like, if you got like braids and shit, niggas don't be want to fuck that shit up. But I can't personally wear that shit. I got to wear a do-rag. But some niggas wear their bonnets. I, it helped though. I be seeing niggas, it helped. I ain't never seen no nigga wear a bonnet unless he was joking. <laughs> I swear, I know quite a few niggas. I know quite a few niggas. All right. So who you? Why you don't? Um, I know a couple of people like helping, like small YouTubers get big, and they like gonna pay them, right? Like the small YouTubers gonna pay them when they get up, right? Mm. Why you ain't never think about doing no shit like that? Well, like fucking with a bigger YouTuber. No, helping small helping YouTubers. Somebody. I mean, personally. I still consider myself a small YouTuber, for real, for real. Cause like I got the I got the subs, but niggas not active on my shit like that. Like I should be getting way more views than I am now. But mm. I don't never, yeah, I don't really never look at nobody like they smaller than me type shit. I like working with motherfuckers regardless of the subscribers you got. I be feeling what people be young like when they do got a lot of subscribers, they really don't want to work with people that's smaller than them. Cause it's like. I want to say it's it's, benef it's not beneficial, but it ain't because they not really getting nothing in return on their end. But they could any day, like, they could just go help a small YouTuber, but that's not what a lot of niggas be on. But I for yeah. sure like working with motherfuckers. Yeah, I do too. It's better than doing videos by yourself. It's like you're yeah. talking to yourself. <laughs> that, shit, that shit way funner doing videos with people. I ain't gonna lie. But you can get real creative, like, when you're doing shit by yourself too. Yeah, I be thinking about doing so many pranks on people. Man. It's weird. Them pranks coming soon on my channel. I ain't gonna lie. Did you see that? That let me run the train on you prank? That I did. I seen, I seen like five minutes of that bitch, but I was like, I can't. Not on, on <laughs> you, but I was like, I already know how this going to play out. And I was like, I can't. Because that's good. I like, I can't even see <laughs> Man, that shit was so funny. But I gotta do a video with that nigga too. I, I that ain't, shot? uh, yeah, I had just found out about Dog like a week before you posted that shit. Yeah, I've been knowing him though before that, before he started YouTube. We just ain't never fucked with each other. Just like really good. That nigga funny though. Okay. He is. And the other nigga we was do that was on the video with us, DJ. Oh, yeah. The other nigga that was on, he do YouTube too. Well, he be on YouTube doing this, pranks. Tap in. They I gonna see this. Tap in. Lie. Best friend, tap in. Like, y'all gonna see a lot of collabs coming this next two months, like March and February. A lot with me. Yeah, a lot. 
a lot with a lot of YouTubers. Like, and I'm gonna be doing um music features and shit too. So y'all gonna see a lot of shit from that too. Who you who you plan on doing a feature with? I ain't gonna lie, I got a lot of features in the way. I I know like people don't know that I know a lot of people. Like niggas that got names too. But it's like you know, niggas be working a lot, so it's like I don't wanna hit a nigga up and just be like, yeah, let's do this feature. Cause some niggas don't be on that same type of time. Some niggas want cheese. And I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, I don't, I don't mind paying a nigga for a feature, but it's the way you go about it type shit. Right. So me starting off, I'ma just do features with niggas I know. Like, for real, for real, no. All right, so y'all get up there? Yeah. That's smart, that's what's up. Cause some niggas, they, they, they be iffy, I ain't gonna lie. But generally, right now, Detroit, niggas been collabing a lot. You got dreads. No, I be using that shit to grow my hair. But I plan on getting individual braids once my shit long enough. Mm -hmm. you, your shit is, uh, you want your shit nah, pop yeah, smoke? Yeah, I, I don't want no short ass. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I can't have them short You got no little babies. So I'm gonna just wait on They should be straight by the summer. That's when I'm gonna put them in. But until then, I'm gonna just like in and out with the fro and shit. Uh, that sound good. In and out with the fro. I cut my hair. My hair was way longer than this. After me and my nigga broke up, I had to cut my hair. She was trying to trying to come with something different type shit. No, my hair was falling out. It was bad. Uh -huh. And it was damaged because I kept putting heat on my hair. And it make my hair like one side to be straight and the other side to be curly. Oh, yeah. That's how my... Bro. And this girl named Kanessa. <laughs> she fucking flat iron my hair. Whole time, she flat iron my shit. And then still I like, need twist my shit for my dress. So I'm like, dog, she just fucked up my hair. So now I got to get my, um, what did you call it? A pattern? Like for your hair? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got to get my pattern and shit back right. But once my shit, like, get longer, I'm going to cut my shit down again. Like, if you can't tell, I just fucked up my hair again. Like, you see how this straight? Yeah. But the rest of my hair curly, my hair is, like, it's not good with heat. Yeah, so my shit is, like, in my different hair. areas, it's different texture. Yeah. My dude said told me that shit when she was, uh, dreading my shit. She was like, you got some areas, your shit straight as hell, and then some areas, your shit curly. I don't know. She was low key mad as hell at me because she know my shit be curly for real, for real. That's yeah, because you let look a lot foreign touch for real, for shit. real. Man, I don't let people touch my hair because I be mad as hell when somebody fuck my shit up. I done had a couple times where a nigga to fuck my line though. That's why you can't be trusted, <laughs> nigga, with your hair, bro. You can't just let everybody touch bro. your shit. That's the thing about moving to a new city. You don't know who can cut yeah, what, see, who can do what. You nervous, but you the shit got to. You test the shit if you want to. <laughs> you gonna be mad as hell. You gonna be mad. But shit, you gotta try certain shit out. Like you, you can't duck certain shit. But especially if you gonna move. I'm thinking about um learning how to line and cut up hair too. That shit easy. I, ain't I used to cut lie. my own hair. I'm thinking about doing that because I want to sell my own brand of clippers and shit. Shit smart too. What you gonna sell them to the barber shops? I wanna put them bitches in stores. Oh yeah, that shit smart. I ain't even gonna cut. You just gotta talk to motherfuckers, go up there and be like, yeah, I sell I sell clippers and shit. Not like that, but you get what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> tell them like your product and shit and then tell them like I wanna place it in here. Sometimes you could let your shit go, like I don't need you ain't even gotta pay me for these, like just put them on the shelves type shit. Right. Like that's but what thing I'm gonna is, do for my clothes. I don't know what the fuck. Like I don't know what what's good about clippers. Clippers, I gotta learn, it's, like, it's different clippers. Right, I know that, but like, what's the best ones? What's the ones? The the best ones, in my opinion, is the ones that like they all around use, like all purpose clippers. Mm. Like some clippers just for lining, and some of them just for your um, taper. taper and shit. Yeah, but it's a certain set of clippers where you can use it for all of them. And they come with like different clips and shit. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get into. I ain't gonna lie. I'm trying to get deep into that. I'm sure my shit. I want my shit in stores, barbershops, shit, and at home in your bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> for real, for you gotta real. just keep pressing your shit. Like regardless of what your product is, you just gotta keep promoting your shit. Right. That's what I see. Like my friend. She be doing YouTube, and she she just like oh she only got like. 
like 200 some subscribers, but she always doing another video. She got like way yeah, more videos. Consistency than. for sure. Right. And she taught herself how to do all that shit. So I asked her like, shit, help me out. How you make the videos? That's how I go. Bro. I don't know how to make my videos for shit. But shit, I downloaded all the little. You you got an iPhone, right? Yeah. Is iMovie that? right on your shit? That's the little lemonade shit. There. Uh, they that really shit just pour that shit at the bottom and then pour the lemonade in there. Oh, cause that shit look like motherfucking. I thought that shit was for some odd reason. I thought it was like Boy, weed, shit. Shit, oh. weed shit. Weed shit. The uh, tobacco. <laughs> <laughs> she throws some white ass in her shit. 